Hi. Still stuffy. But I buzzed the sides of my hair. Not as short as usual because it's too cold. So I just want to style my hair now that it's getting dry. My hair is very easy to style. I'm going straight. Because I feel like it. That's why. Because I feel like it. So if anyone's like, how long does it take you to do your hair? I'll show you. <laughs> no cut. And this is the Conair uh, flatter. It's like slightly curved, as you can see. It wasn't very expensive. Conair wrote his essay on it, and I never seem to know. It was fairly inexpensive. It's only about an inch wide, um, not barrel, inch wide plate, but it works, as you can see, pretty quickly on my hair. I only did one pass, and it's already starting to smooth very nicely. I don't like to stay on too long, but at the same time, I don't like to do too many passes. Uh, so let's do this. Let's do one, and then we'll do another section because our hair. only goes down the middle we can just keep going back in sections I think I just grabbed the same thing you know it's so much neater when I'm not filming but I guess how would you know right <laughs> I could just say that but it's true oh no it's true that's all that matters This is mostly straightened at this point. My hair is pretty fine and it only curls when it's really on the thin side. It usually waves when it's on the thicker, healthier side, which I think sounds backwards to some people, but that's just my hair texture. It, um, when it's heavier, it has nice waves and ringlets at the end. And when it's light, it does these weird little just partial curl, partial wave things sometimes. See? See how it's quick? It really doesn't take very much to do my hair. <sighs> if I had more of it, it still wouldn't take very much. This section goes way too big. This is what happens when you rush big sections and then you realize you're not saving any time doing bigger sections because you got to go over them a million times so just do small sections go down and keep going then again i am not a hairdresser and i only have dealt with my hair so what would i know <laughs> but if your hair is thin like mine and does the same thing as mine yeah There's still a wave to it. I could totally flatten it, but I don't know if I want to. Do you like that? You want to keep that little curve in because it is too short and toppy. It doesn't really look right when it's completely straight. I don't know if it looks right when it's like this, actually. It looks kind of more like a mom haircut. But I am a mom, so whatever. Okay, so let's just fix up some of these little waves, and I would section properly, but like I said, as you can see, my hair goes right down the middle, everything takes very long to straighten up. I'd like to speak to your manager, so I could kick her ass. <laughs> no, not really. Alright, so... That's pretty much it. I'm not going nuts on my hair because because I don't want to. <sighs> sniffle, sniffle, sniffle. Tons of people watching me do this. Like, why are you doing it like that? Because you're not here to help me. 
because I like it like that. I don't know why, because I feel like it. Nobody really cares. Everyone's so worried about how they look. You think somebody's going to come up to me and say, oh, your face. No, nobody does. But people um, in general, to your face at least, are too polite to do that. So I kind of take advantage of that and say, you're going to say something to me about my hair. Are you just going to stare at me and shake your head? He looks awful. Probably the second one doesn't really affect me. You don't have to like it. <laughs> oh, oh, I like it when it's like this more. It's more together. It's more uh, dense. It tends to pat in makeup a little better. Sometimes I push it out when I want it to be out a little bit more. Yes, I know I have veins under my eyes that are very visible. Uh, I guess not really dark circles, just could use with some, could use, could use some evening. Evening? Uh, not meaning nighttime, meaning evening out of the skin, but you guessed it. I don't care. <laughs> I just don't. Uh, but I will, just for fun. I have a Maybelline, I still have the price on it, Maybelline Master Contour by Face Studio. Mm, light to medium. It's like this. So it has a Rite Aid sticker and a price. And I have my little, my little brush set from Rite Aid. And I'm sorry I keep looking in the wrong camera. I'm, I told you, I'm just going to do that forever. This is the extent of my contouring. Ooh, it accentuated a line that was already there. Yay! Oh, it did it again. Wow, what a huge difference. Okay. Oh, let's contour the jaw. Oh, yes, let's contour that jaw. I don't contour. <laughs> Can you tell? Don't put here, oh my goodness, because of these widow's peak situations that we got going on. We gotta hide those. People don't have those all the time. Oh wait, they do. <laughs> I think the only person who would ever like say anything to me about something like that is a stranger on the internet who's just being mean. They'd say, oh, you look gross. <laughs> and um, I've dealt with that already. Uh, I've dealt with all sorts of fun stuff in life and on the internet. I used to be on Newgrounds making flash games. And even when people can't see you, they can be really mean. So, a little bit of blush. Let's come up so little you can barely see it. Because that's how I like it. Oh, is there blush there? No? Mm, there is. I can see it. I know you can. That's all that matters. I feel like there's no blush on your cheeks. There is. I promise. I think what happens is a lot of young people on YouTube, either it's because they're in front of a camera, so their face, you know, you could take, put a lot of, like I could put tons of makeup on, on and it'll look good on camera. But in real life, it'll just look cakey and creasy. I think that's what happens sometimes on YouTube, but also, they're all younger than me. <laughs> they're all a lot younger than me, so <laughs> it's one of those things where I notice it, and that's all that really matters. Sometimes that's just how you gotta live your life. I like it, and that's all that matters. What, you mean you don't like what I've done to my eye? You don't like the way I look? Uh, I. <laughs> you don't like the way I put my makeup on? Oh no, my whole day is ruined. I used to let that happen. I don't let that happen anymore. So 
if anyone's wondering, are you going to put anything else in your eye? Mascara. That's about it. Again, I'm not feeling so great today. The fact that I'm attempting to look presentable, I'm happy about that because I'm perfectly content to walk out of the house without makeup on, my hair looking jacked as all hell, and, and that's pretty much it. Um, looking like it, like, this is how I dress a lot. I'm feeling a little extra with my sickness today, if that makes sense. Like, sometimes, uh, sometimes I, uh, do that thing where I just act a little crazier, a little sillier when I'm feeling like garbage because I'm trying to pick myself up a little when... Oh, we got Revlon Supermodel. What is this? Revlon Colorstay Ultimate Suede Supermodel. Oh, girl, I'll put this on. I'm going to look like a supermodel. Get a little taste. Sorry, did you see up my nose right there? It's big, I can't help it. I don't look like a supermodel. They lied. No. So all I wanted to say was if you're feeling like garbage, I'm sorry, and I hope you feel better. I'm tired. I'm going to go now, and I hope you have a wonderful day. I hope life gives you what you need. I hope it gives everybody what they need, good or bad. Sometimes you need a smack in the ass. <laughs>